Hi guys, we are going to discuss the biology section of the Lucent book and uh, the first topic which we have in hand is the important terms of biology. The important terms of biology or you can say the different branches of biology that are studied in biology. Suppose anatomy, ag uh, agrology etc. So many of these you already know. We will be doing this part, the uh, important terms of biology in, in two parts. This is the first part. Okay. So the first one is the anatomy. Anatomy is the internal structure of the organism. I have underlined internal structure because it is important. It is not the external structure but the internal structure is anatomy. The second one is agrology. Agrology is the production of crop. Agrology. You already know what is agro. Agro is related to agriculture and logy. Study. So study of production of crops. Okay. The other one is agronomy. See agro means crop right and the nomi the nomi means uh, study of soil management and production of crop so that is agronomy there is a difference between agrology and agronomy which is explained over here very clearly okay the another important one is agrostology agrostology is study of grass study of grass is called agrostology in greece in Greek language, agrostis. Agrostis means grass. It's a type of grass. And uh, agrostis, it comes from the root word agrostis. And agrostology means study of grass. Okay, arthrology. We, you have heard the term arthritis. Arthritis is the pain of joints, right? Or the swelling of joints, which is uh, um, mainly seen in older people. So that is arthrology, study of joints, apiculture. See, apiculture is a study of bees, B -E -S, B's, madhumakki, honeybee. Right. Um, let's know the scientific name of bee, the honeybee. It is Apis macularis. Sorry, Apis malicifera. Right. So A-P-I-S, Apis. Apis means bee. So if you are doing apiculture, you are studying the bees, rearing of bees. See culture, culture is rearing or uh, you may say you are petting the bees, you are uh, growing them for uh, economic profit. So that is culture. Suppose sericulture is the um, growing of silk or um, rearing of skill, silk worms right so see i will discuss only the important ones anthropology we know the study of human race and all that study anthology anthology is a study of flowers and traveling plants anthology antho a n t h o anthology means study of flowering plants okay the other one is angiology angiology is, study, is the study of blood vessels and uh, arteries and veins See, you must have heard about the word angioplasty, in which, in which what happens, you, uh, the the bloods, the blood vessels are repaired by the help of operation. That is angioplasty. So the same in the same manner, angiology is the study of blood vascular system like arteries, veins, etc. Andrology is the study of male organs. We have already seen this in the word power it made easy discussion see uh, word in the discussions of word power made easy there are many other terms like the study on different um, scientific branches so it is better you go through them as well okay uh, the next one is bryology bryology is the study of bryophytes you know what are bryophytes you have seen the moss growing at the side of the road in rainy season the green thing that is moss they are bryophytes and when you will study the classification of animal and plant kingdom you will know what are bryophytes right so in the study of bryophytes is called bryology okay biometrics you know that is related to Aadhaar card and all bio biomedical engineering you know biotechnology you know bacteriology study of bacteria cytology study of cell very important cytology c-y-t-o-l-o-g study of cell okay cryobiology 
cryo cryobiology wherever the word cryo comes c r y o cryo comes it means that it is related to very low temperatures and cryobiology is the study of organism or organism behavior in mm, at very low temperatures okay you know what is a clone you know what is cardiology demography is the study of population you must have come across the word demo dem or demo means uh, related to people or the crowd or population demography is the study of population diffusion we have already studied in lower classes dermatology is the study of skin epidermis and all pachyderm we have come across these words in uh, word power made, made easy discussions dendrochronology counting and analyzing annual growth of tree is known to know its age see whenever you cut a uh, very old tree the trunk of the old tree you will see many rings rings and by counting those rings you will be able to tell what is the age of that tree so this science is called dendrochronology dendrochronology chrono means time and logy means study dendro means age so dendrochronology dendro is related to wood dendro is related to wood okay moving on to the next one ecology you know what is ecology evolution you know embryology okay there is one important term over here zygote 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 is the zygote is the a result of the combination of male and female gametes it is called zygote when the ovum and uh, sperm meet they form the zygote and from that the embryo develops okay eugenics you have you have heard the word you 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 means good you means better you means good so eugenics eugenics is the uh, improvement of human race study of factors connected to the improvement of human race is called eugenics okay that is eugenics and eugenics eugenics it is uh, also for the betterment of the human beings and it is the environment in which the people are living for the betterment so eugenics is the development of the human beings human race and eugenics is the environment study of environment in which the human race develops to become better and uh, Euphenics is the treatment of defective or inherited tree through genetic engineering. See, euphenics is also for the betterment of the human being, but it is a genetic study. Euphenics, U E U P H E N I C S, euphenics. Okay, ethnology, ethnology. It comes from the word ethos. Ethos means behavior. So, ethnology is the study of sorry, ethology is the study of behavior of. the animals in their natural habitat suppose humans are a social animal man is a social animal it is a social environment and the people behave socially so that is ethology suppose similar is the case with the other animals as well in their natural habitat they behave in a particular manner so that is studied under ethology okay etiology study of causative agent of diseases ato e t i o l o g y or a i t i o l o g y both are the same and they mean the cause of the disease what is the agent of cause of disease ato the word etios etios a i t i o s etios means cause cause of the disease the study of the cause of the disease is called etiology okay floriculture you we we already seen what is a entomology in a word power made easy book it is the study of insects and why it is called entomology we have discussed in detail over there so i wanted to discuss over here again exobiology exobiology study of possibility of life in space floriculture is the cultivation of flowering plants food technology forensic science fishery forestry okay fermentation fermentation is the anaerobic respiration of uh, organic matter in which 
ethyl alcohol is produced you must have uh, you must have studied uh, aerobic respiration and anaerobic respiration so when anaerobic respiration takes place mm. when anaerobic respiration takes place a byproduct ethyl alcohol is uh, is uh, created which is used as a liquor so this process is called fermentation okay genetics growth genetic engineering gynecology gerontology study of uh, aging study of aging we have already studied this gerontology ger means age aged people old ger means old and uh, gastroenter gastroenterology gastro means related to stomach entero means entero means inside so what is happening inside the stomach is called gastroenterology study of ailment elementary canal of stomach and intestine related disorders okay hypertonic and hypotonic hyper hyper means more tonic means solution so if you have a hypertonic it is a concentrated solution it is a concentrated solution and hypotonic it is a uh, solution with less concentration see it is a situation of comparison um, two solutions are there one of them will be hypertonic and the other one will be hypotonic with respect to each other okay okay homeothermic that means um, animals who have constant body temperature are called homeothermic or warm blooded animals mammals are warm blooded animals right so they are homeothermic they can control their temperature themselves they have constant body temperature like hygiene hydrophonics hydrophonics is the study of growth of plants without soil uh, only in water only in water with the added nutrients to it so, so that is hydrophonics hydrophonics phonics not phonics 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 means sound phonics means development or growth okay hematology study of blood and hepatology hepatology hepa hepa means liver liver so study of liver is called hepatology okay this is the first part this was the first part of the um, study of different branches of biology and we will meet you in the second part as well please do hit a like and share the video and uh, very soon by night you will be getting uh, sorry by morning because mm, this is the night time by morning you will be getting the next video so take care bye have a good one